earth to do. It's just, he's understanding it a little bit more, but it was a lot. Anyway. Yeah. And just kind of to tie into what you were just talking about, I was actually going to ask this a little bit later, but since you're on that topic, um, so women who are single, like myself, for example, um, I date, but I don't have a partner and who knows when I'll have that, that, that life partner. I may never have that life partner, but I do want to have that journey of being a mother and that experience of being a mother. So what would you say to single women who want to start that journey and don't have a partner? Is it worth the struggle to go ahead and just be a single mother? You know, it's not easy. Um, Just being a mother and being a single mother, I think, unfortunately, if you want to go on that journey, because a few of my friends that got to a certain age that want wanted kids they found literally one of my friends just recently found this guy they're very close friends like they ended up having a child together and uh she makes it seem like he has nothing to do with her life like he was just literally a donor so she could have a child but she has a great support system and that's the thing too a lot of people stay in situations or can't do something because they don't have, you need a support system mm-hmm. or you need the money. Right. And it's sad, but it's true. It's just, you know, if you're a career woman, um, I think it's great, um, but daycare is not cheap. It mm-hmm. gets easier. And I think I was blessed. I was able to have the strength because I had the support from my, my parents. Otherwise, I don't know what I, I, I might had to have stayed a little longer mm-hmm. until I figured it out, you know, and then another friend of mine, I know it's not easy, but she adopted um, a child, like a newborn, pretty much. There was a family that just couldn't take care of the child. Mm -hmm. And um, it was, you know, and not a close family friend, but a close family friend, a friend of a friend um, that they took on their child. But, and then my mother's friend also went through the process of getting a donor she didn't know him though Mm -hmm. like it's like an actual i forget what it's called but she you know got a sperm donor and she did a great job um her parents are very old but she was able to pay for um for you know help and like a living nanny a little bit i mean she's at like an average work in america and she's not you know um but it was somebody that was like an older woman that needed a place to live at the time and she took care of her child while she worked now the kids five six and it's easier because they go to school but you figure it out you turn that like that cap on where it's like Mm -hmm. you're forced to figure it out like before i was a mom like i was like i'm I'm never gonna be able to do this there's no i would have been like i can't do it but you just do it yeah and you figure it out it's like that switch just clicks on instinct Yeah. yeah and you and you want that i would I would say go for it and figure it out because you become, if you're already that way, you become 10 times more of a woman, mm-hmm. 10 times more of a ambitious go-getter, yeah. like hard worker and things just start happening for you. I don't yeah. Know, like, that makes me sound, uh, feel hopeful. <laughs> no, it's true. Like I think I, and not that I was complacent, but I, 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 I think I definitely stepped outside of my comfort zone personally and, um, and uh, professionally, mm-hmm. yeah. I became Makes a mom. Sense. And I think I got a lot of opportunities because, you know, that's why a lot of people go, oh, these, you know, famous people or, you know, rappers or this or that, artists, like they, you know, they have these stories. And it's like, yeah, they do. And that's why they had no choice. Right. It's they almost stay like- there or figure it out. And they didn't have options. But like, when you do have options, you just kind of like last. You don't have options. You like figure it out, and you become this like monster of a of a mom or a woman or a person. Right. It's like being a mom makes you fearless, and that trickles into all the other aspects of your life too. Yeah. Yeah. It definitely puts a fire under your butt for sure. You were single.